My name is uh, Umkhtabit. Uh, my name, the Blackfoot name for it is uh, Big Eagle, and my name is Dan Fox, and I'm from here, from the Blood Tribe. White bucket with oats. They usually see I'm it? charging, yeah. <laughs> but uh, I'll see if I can call them in from the, the hay. This is a good time of the night because this is when we're all foraging and getting ready for, for their drink. If I can get the lead cow's attention, they'll come over. <laughs> I usually have an eagle whistle, that's how I get their attention and they come, they come flying over and I feed them. My goal and my, my outlook is to see the bison return in every which way, small land. If they have 10 acres, let's put two bison on there. If they have 100 acres, let's put 30. You know, everywhere there's, 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 there's room for them. They're, they need to come back. Why? Why do the buffalo need to come back? Well, first of all, that's our culture, that's our history, that, that was our way of life. And they took, it, they took them away from us so they could, they, could weaken, they could weaken us, and that's what they did. They weakened us so bad that, you know, we were put on reserves, and they were put in parks, and they were, they were shot, they were killed, but they didn't do that to us. They, they starved us because we didn't have any more animals to eat. But because, you know, the, you know, the the bison are so a keystone part of not only the environment but in in the traditional indigenous way of life. That's that was our that was our our heartbeat. So now that the bison is coming back, the ceremonies are 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 getting are coming back in a good way in a strong uh, spiritual way.